Long, long ago in the animal kingdom, there lived a very proud lion. He was cruel. He killed animals for fun. And the other animals in the jungle were very scared of him. They were also worried about the fate of the jungle. As the lion killed more animals than he could eat, the other animals called a meeting. What should we do? This way, there shall be no animals left in the jungle. I have an idea. Let us tell the lion that we shall send him his food every day. Each day, one of us will have to go to the lion willingly to save the rest of the jungle. This was a sad choice, but the animals had to agree to it. The wolf conveyed the plan to the lion. The lion joyfully agreed. Great! Now I can get my food without hunting for it. Wow! So, each day, one animal or the other went to the lion. First, it was the turn of the buffalo. The next day, the deer went to the lion. Then, it was the turn of the zebra. This went on for a while. One day, it was the turn of the rabbit to become the lion's lunch. The rabbit walked through the jungle and kept thinking about how to escape the lion. He took a long time to reach the lion's den. When he reached the lion's den, it was late afternoon. And the hungry lion was very angry. Where have you been? I am starving. You are so small, you will not satisfy my hunger. I shall make the animals pay for sending me such a small meal. I'm sorry, O King. But I got late because of another lion in the jungle. He wanted to eat me and said that he was our king. The king, huh? So what else did he say? When I told him I was to be your lunch, he laughed and challenged you to a game of strength. He said he was sure you would lose to him. The lion was very angry by now. He roared! Take me to this lion. I shall show him who the real king is. I shall, my lord. The clever rabbit took the lion to a well and pointing to it, he said, The lion peeped into the well and saw his own reflection, but he thought it was another ferocious angry lion. He roared! Whoa! An echo came back as an even bigger roar. Whoa! I shall show you 
the foolish lion jumped into the well to fight his enemy. The rabbit happily went back into the jungle and told the other animals what had happened. The animals praised the rabbit and lived on peacefully in the